there are two branches of evolutionary theory. There's, there's evolutionary theories about how new forms of life arose from simpler pre-existing forms. That's what we've just been talking about. Mm -hmm. And that theory involves all three of those elements, the idea that there's change over time, but secondly, that the change has been continuous so that the history of life can, should, is best depicted as a great branching tree. And then thirdly, the idea that there is an undirected, unguided, materialistic mechanism that is capable of producing all the change implied by the tree and therefore all the forms of life on earth. That, that set of propositions together attempts to explain the origin of new forms of life from simpler pre-existing forms of life on this planet. But it does not attempt to explain the origin of the very first form of life. And that falls mm. to another theory of an other, another branch of evolutionary theory. And that is a branch of evolutionary theory that's sometimes called chemical evolution, mm. 